every year I try to take at least one trip to refresh myself and to recover from the busyness of life. This year I went to Venice and I hope you enjoy following my adventure. Good morning guys. It is 2.30 in the morning. It's very early. I didn't really sleep that much so I'm a little bit tired but today is a good day because me and my cousin are heading to Venice. We're just waiting for the coach to the airport now and London's airports most of them are like quite far out so the coach is an hour to the airport and then a car another car and then from the airport to Venice I think it's two hours um, oh the coach is here how do I put you in it as well <laughs> This is my cousin Tamsin. Um, so we're going to Venice for five days. We got some granola and bananas. What did you get? Mango and lime. I don't know. I just wanted fruits and mango and uh, coconut. Granola. Yeah. Muesli. Muesli. So you just got two mangoes. <laughs> We have made it to Venice. Woo! So we've been traveling for a long time. We woke up at, we, we started traveling at 2.30 and it's now 12. Yeah. We have checked into our hotel, which is actually really nice. And Venice is just so beautiful. Like there's so many small canals going through like literally every single street. And there's, there's one right here. But now we are going to get pizza from a like cheap restaurant. Yeah. Um, we just want a little snack. We didn't really eat anything today. After we finished our gelato, we headed to St. Mark's Square. This is the centre of Venice and it's where a lot of the museums are, so you have to go there if you visit Venice. On this day though, we were a bit tired, so we didn't want to queue for anything. So we just walked around uh, kind of aimlessly down different alleyways, but it was actually really fun to do that. And I think that's one of the beauties of Venice, just walking down the streets and finding your own treasures. So we just got back to the hotel, it's 5pm, we are going to stay here for like an hour or two and then get dinner. We don't know where we're going to go but we yeah. saw like a lot of places. Oh, we're just so tired, we walked so much, my feet. We didn't uh, get proper sleep as well. Yeah, because we only slept for like two hours. Yeah. Yeah. But Venice is so nice, so pretty, so many like canals and alleyways. Yeah. And then we both fell asleep for like three hours, but it started to rain at the same time, so we didn't really miss that much. Whilst I was in Venice, I kind of developed a watermelon addiction because they sell watermelon in like these little boxes and I just kept buying them. So this is a clip of me eating watermelon for like 20 minutes before we went to bed. Right now, Zach is missing and he's a priority. If she wants a deal, she'll get one. He is. I first like that you've got it. We don't have time to hammer out the logistics. A victim? Those photos were personal. At 
Rialto market, we got some grapes and some dried mango and we just ate them by the canal for a bit, it was very nice. We then got some gelato which I think is actually the best one I had in the whole um, trip. And I got some cherry and pistachio gelato, it's so good. And then we went to St Mark's um, Basilica in St Mark's Square. We have walked a lot today. We went to St Mark's Square and we went inside the Basilica, the church. Tomorrow is the day we're going to go on the boats and go on the canals. So yes, we had a bit of like a weird incident with this lady who like pushed into the queue with us. She like pretended that she knew us. She was like, oh, is this, is this a line for the Basilica? I thought, I thought she was just going to go straight to the back. So I was like, oh yeah, this is a line. And then and she, she just, just, stayed just there stood in there. The queue, like so is this a, okay. Yeah, we'll do, we'll do an impression. So this is me, I'm just like minding my own business. Excuse me, so is this a line to the um, museum? Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> she just stood there, she didn't even move. So every time like the queue like moved forward, she, would she just was- She just walked with us. With us. I'm just like, what the hell? So then we were like, we were gonna snitch on her at the front of the line, and tell the ticket person yeah. like, oh she pushed in. But then at the <laughs> ticket, like it got so crazy because they were like, they wouldn't let you in if you had a bag. Yeah. Then it got too confusing and she like went through and then we... And we saw yeah. her Yeah, oh, and she kept, then she tried to speak to us. Yeah, she was trying to speak she to us. She was like, oh, they let you guys in. So yeah, we, we, had, a bit, we had a bit of a fight today. What did you get, Tamsin? I got, oh, <laughs> I got me some pina colada that I was looking for for It's not even Italian though, is it? So you got some like non-Italian drink, okay. Yeah, for very cheap, 6 uh, euros and 50 cents. That's not actually cheap though when you look at it. I mean, yeah, I mean in terms of, you know, Venice price. Okay. We got these little. What even is this? Just like I call a them jellyfish lights. Jellyfish light. <laughs> okay, um, show us. Down. <laughs> that was a flop. <laughs> 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 Wow! 